for the serious gamer. Well, hello there, this is... Spotify! At NextGenTactics.com, this is Search and Destroy, our assault series for Karachi. Here is my class and killstreak configuration. Yeah. And this is our offense. Oh, so yeah. We're taking the bomb to B. We're taking the bomb to B. Look at it, I'm even ahead of the, the rest of the group. I mean, this isn't even my rush class video. And I'm, at, I'm in front of the group. Okay, so I got a claymore. I have my Scar H, I have Scavenger. And apparently there's somebody nearby. And now he's not because he had Scrambler on. Now I do like coming in here because I usually sit right behind that plant over there. I don't know, for some reason... Wow, another dude with Scrambler? Unless that was the same dude from before, but I thought he looked like the Scrambler disappeared pretty quick and he died. So there's probably two guys in their team with Scrambler. <clears throat> but I do like... I don't know, for some reason with this game... And you just tripped my Claymore. For some reason in this game, I like hiding near plants. And I just saw that red blip. So we're gonna go up and get him. I mean, may as well. Oh, there's another guy trying to sneak up the back end, huh? Nah, huh? Nah, uh? No way. That, ladies and gentlemen, is why you need to keep your ears open. You need to be listening, because you will hear that. Unless I have Ninja Pro one, you don't have Sit Rep Pro. You're gonna hear that. So we got two guys. Look at that. I heard him too. And we got a UAV. Oh, wow. What do you know? He doesn't have cold blooded. Okay, so we're gonna grab the bomb. The guy's still over towards A. So we're gonna come over and we're gonna plant at B, likely. Wow, we almost ate a Claymore there. Now, with our assault class, that Claymore should have killed us. So that wasn't proper Claymore placement. Even though I didn't see it, I could tell already. The guy just jumped out of the second story. Because we heard him. And we're just gonna wait. See, there's the bomb right there. That's why we plant on the side. Because we can cover it easier. You know, unless you're gonna plant it at the back and cover it from the other side. But we always plant the bomb on that side. For that reason. Exactly. Okay, so it looks like they're gonna go to a possibly rush plant. We'll see. Who knows, maybe we'll even do some hard camping on this round. I can't wait. Maybe not. I don't know, the assault series slash tactical series, we will do some camping for sure. But anyways, uh, technically we're not camping now that we're, we've planted the bomb, so really you're supposed to camp the bomb site, so it's okay now. And we're going to get a couple guys coming through the middle here. And I don't know if we heard that guy or not, but there he comes. Boston, you came with the ladder again. Search and destroy. And this is our last round of offense. Looks like we're going to B again. And we're going to stick with the bomb carrier. We'll plant a, um, a claymore right in that position. So we don't get flanked. And then we're going to see if we can go into our spot. But Oh, there's Ern. Saved his ass. Oh shit, you saved my life. <clears throat> Oh yeah, direct impact. Oh, nice. oh, by the way, I'm using a noob tube in case you didn't notice. Is that direct impact? I got you. I got you. I mean, I'm trying to camp and use a noob tube and piss people off. That's what I'm trying to do here. So this is exactly the reason why. Again, the reason why we plant to the side of that uh, target because I can defend from this spot and I can hit anybody that's going to go in there to defuse. And we get the last kill with a noob tube. Which really pisses people off. It's kind of fun. Okay, on to defense. And this is kind of similar. Actually, the sniper series is now, but you will see the sniper series. Um, you can do, like, a lot of things that I do with the assault class, you can do with a sniper. And we're going to just watch the B target. We can see the two windows on the right hand side over there. In the bottom level and the top level. And there's a guy in the top level. There we go. Let's use our predator and see if we can't get a kill. And we don't. That's too bad. We do have a care package. 
Not sure if we're going to do anything with it at this point. We'll probably use it at the beginning of the next round. Remember, this isn't a continuous game. This is... Or these are rounds pieced together from various games. I like uh, coming in here. You can actually drop down to the second uh, sort of level here by this sign. And I'll use it to camp out A, and I'll tell my teammate to stay over at B. Until me or him see somebody. And we're just going to wait. And watch. And listen. And camp. We do hear some sounds like stun grenades being thrown. I'm not sure if we just fell off there or what. <clears throat> Actually, we wanted to get back up so we can go over. Because it does sound like... This is occurring over at uh, the B target, so we're going to see if we can help Dark Cloud out here. Again, just watching those two windows. And what do you know, there is the guy over there. Not sure if it's just one guy left or not. So we're still not sure, I mean, don't know if he's going to come over to B or not. I guess we'll see. We end up going back over to A. Just to check. And no, he's not there, so likely. Or is he? No, likely. It's going to be, of course. Okay, so we're going to get our ass back over here. We call in our care package. Just kind of want to use it as a diversion. And looks like they called in a care package. So maybe they're using it as a diversion, but I'm going to try and stun the guy. But, and he is there. So that was kind of... I don't know. I don't know if I was him, I wouldn't necessarily have called in that care package. And it looks like there was only one guy left, so... We get the defuse. So I'm not sure what the hell he was doing with that care package, to be honest with you. I don't know why dude was trying to take care of that. And apparently his teammates don't know why he was calling in that care package. Yeah, it's kind of weird. Yeah, their 10th level legit, eh? My ass. Oh yeah, okay, so this is a game versus some 10th level prestigers. Uh, this was actually a while ago when that hack was pretty, uh, pretty widely used. And they're trying to tell us they're legit. And we do have the noob tube equipped here. So we went over to cover A. There are some guys over at B. Our teammates uh, is telling us that the bomb is over at B. There is another guy over at A here. And we're going to... There he is. Jumping down from the building. We're going to try and get him. Possibly with the noob. And... There it is. So that's it for Karachi. Uh, a little bit of assault slash tactical slash... A little bit of camping... Um, we have more we have we have more camping examples and or hard camping in some of our other my other tactical slash assault videos upcoming and you know stay tuned visit www.nextgentactics.com for more I'm Spiderbite and we'll see you soon.